What's up YouTube, I'm EVScape and welcome back to another video. Now boys, recently uh, I made a series, how quickly can I make a pure with unlimited money, you know? And we managed to bang out a pure and it was like 36 hours or something like that. A one defense pure, 85-85 uh, set, ready to PK, awesome. But uh, this year I do want to learn how to PK on a bunch of different builds. Uh, the PvP All-Stars, there was a 1 defense build, a 70 defense build, and a 45 defense build. I mean, hopefully this year, maybe potentially I get invited to PvP All-Stars 2. And if I do, I want to be able to have all of these accounts to practice on. So what we're going to be doing is finishing off the series. We made a pure in 36 hours. I now want to see how fast I can make a Zerka account with unlimited money. And then after that, I want to see how quickly I can make myself a 70 defense, mid-level, rigor, augury kind of account with unlimited money. Now, the one thing that is big about these two accounts that we're going to be making is the fact that we are going to need to get Barrow's Gloves on both of them. Now, everyone knows that Barrow's Gloves are the worst part of any account. However, I came across a while ago this man... Uh, I'll leave a link to his YouTube in the description that speed runs Barrow's gloves and he even came out with a Google document which I'll leave in the description uh, if I remember came out with a Google document that basically tells you how to speed run recipe for disaster and get Barrow's gloves so what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be speed running Barrow's gloves all of the quests, all of the requirements, level three account. The world record is 22 hours and 27 minutes. However, he got this over a year ago and even said himself that it is definitely beatable. So we're even going to be trying to go for the world record fastest Barrow's gloves from a level three account. And on top of that, if we don't get it, I'm going to be trying it again on the level 70 account. We're going to attempt to break the world record for the Barrow's Glove speed run while we make a Zerka in the process. So that's what today's video is all about. It's going to be a two-part series for Barrow's Gloves and then another one part to finish off the account, 94 Mage and all that stuff like that. Now, before any of you cheeky cunts in the comment section, and I know at least one of you was thinking about doing this already, before one of you cheeky cunts says this video seemed rushed, that's because I was rushing to get the account done, you cheeky devils. Also, don't forget to take a shot every time I say boys or boom in this video. All right, here we go, boys. We're about to sign in, make our name, do Tutorial Island, and then we're gonna fucking speed run Barrow's Gloves. It's gonna be fucking sick. You ready for this shit? Right, uh... Set name. Boom, did a titter, we got it, boys. And... Boom, there we go, first quest out of the way. Let's log. Nice. Cook's assistant done, boys. I need to dig here, right? Yep, right here. Dig. Nice. Necklace of Passage. Wizard's Tower. I want to try and beat the world record, so. Nice. Im catcher done, boys. Level 8 magic. Get around me. Right. Restless goes done, boys. There we go. That should be it. 43 prayer. Nice. Log out. Beautiful, boys. Beautiful. Which is posting done, boys. All right. Uh, we need to get 10 magic. Very nice. Right. We need to go get some more items before we continue. Look at that, boys. We get 10 mining straight away. Just from doing the quest, you know? Who actually trains these days? Boom, there we go. Goblin diplomacy done. Let's get the fuck out of here. Close. Come on, let's go. Boom. The run saved, boys. The run saved. Let's go. Do -do -do -do. Boom. There we go. Night sword done. Prince Ali rescue done. There we go. Next up, we need to get some more items. Log out. Found the treasure. Beautiful. Done. Use the lamp on agility. Let's go talk to Redbeard Frank. Nice, boys. It's all dead. Nice. There's Vampire Slayer done. You'd love to see that. 20 attacks straight off the bat. Yeah. Is that it? Done. Nice. Let's get out of it and log out. Boom. Let's buy some more items, boys. Thank you very much. Is that done? 
Done. Nice. Now what? Uh, boom. Two birds, one stone. You fucking love to see that, lads. Get, get around me. Get around me. Boom. There we go, boys. 28 quest points already. You fucking love to see that. Right. This should be Plague City done. Nice. Make sure we read this scroll. Very important. Right. Let's give this little boy his balls back. <laughs> nice. There's Druidic Ritual done. Let's get a fucking Earth cast off here. Teleport out. Head to the bank. Let's do it. Fight Arena now done. 32 attack. 14 Thieving. It's all happening, boys. Right, this should be Tree Gnome Village done. Then we're going to go complete the Dwarf Cannon. Nice, let's go. 37 attack, boys. That's what we're talking about. Boom, there we go. Dwarf Cannon done. Let's get out of here. Nine crafting. Thank you very much. Boom, Waterfall Quest. I need five free inventory slots. Are you taking the Mickey, mate? You genuinely have to be taking the piss. Boom, there we go. Nice. This should be tourist trap done. How to use all of my uh, all of my thing on agility. Agility. Tourist trap complete. Okay, beautiful. Let's get the fuck out of here. Uh glory. Well, I'll be fucking damned, boys. This guy's a genius. How about that, lads? Sheep Herder is done. Another quest out of the way. Right, this should be Watchtower done. Beautiful. Can I ultra in this cutscene? I can't. You hate to see this. You really do. You really hate to see this. Boom, there we go. Monk's friend done. Get some woodcutting XP and some lore runes. Nice. And that's Hazel Cult done. Fucking huge. This should be Shield of Arrow complete. Do, do I have to go get fucking... I need both halves! There is the Shield of Arav done, boys. There we go. That should be Priest and Peril done. Nice. We need to talk to Drizzle again to start off Nature Spirit. It is all fucking happening. Right, boys. We're ruining... We are ruining our one defense pure here. It's all over. There it goes. One defense pure. Out the window. No, guys. Oh, man. Pray the fucking altar. What? I didn't know that I was fucking completing this quest. There we go. Another three quest points. Up to 64 now. There we go, boys. Recruitment drive is done. Nice little boost of experience there. You love to see it. Right, now that we're done here, what do we do now? Right. Ichthalurin's little helper done. Beautiful. And now we talk to him again and we start off contact. Here we go. So, we've just done a... Six and a half hour session, seven hour session, maybe. How many hours do you reckon we've got in playtime, guys, for 67 quest points? Four hours, 32 minutes. Okay, that's a little slower than I thought. That's a little slower than I thought. So yesterday, we finished off Inkthorin's little helper. Four hours, 32 minutes. That's what we're up to on the timer. We've got 67 quest points. We need 175. I'm pretty sure at some point throughout here, I'm going to have to train some skills, like thieving or something. But I reckon we could probably get this done in 24 hours. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm confident, boys. Let's, let's fucking do this. Boom, boys. First quest of the day out of the way. Another quest point. Let's go. Okay. Teleport to the Berthorp Games Room. Let's go back to the bank first. There we go. Taylor 2 Cats complete. Mysterious present. What's this? Oh, the mouse toy. Two antique lamps. XP rewards on agility. Let's go, boys. Right, we need to buy some more items now. So I'm going to log out. And there we go, boys. Death Plateau done. 45 attack coming in. And we talk to him again to start off Troll Stronghold. There we go. Give me the Crest Reward. Boom, let's go. Nice. What levels did we get, boys? 42, 42, 48, 34. Nice. Let's go, boys. Yeet, yeet, yeet. That's Dragon Slayer done, boys. Nice. Okay. Let's log out and get some more items. Yeet. Nice, there we go. Lost Tribe done. And now we just enter here. Go on. Use the Slop of Compromise on General Ward face. Boom, Goblin General's done. There we go. 
Let's get out of here. Yay, let's go. Observatory quest done, 24 crafting. Next up, we need to go and do elemental workshop. Boom, elemental workshop one out the way. Let's go get some more shit out the bank, boys. Contact complete, and we're gonna be putting the XP into ranged, I believe. Uh, another wish, ranged. There we go, boys, 24 ranged, love to see it. All right, let's log out. Two gold bars, nice. That's what we like to see, boys. Done. 34 mining. Get that up, you boys. 17 herb lore. Boys, the golem's done. There we go. That's all we're talking about. Right. Um, okay. Okie dokie. This one should be elemental workshop 2 done. Beautiful. Currently set on 86 quest points. This episode is getting extremely long. I think uh, we're just going to get to 100 quest points in this one. I was going to finish off the 176, but... You know, there's just too much going on. So I think I'll finish off 100 quest points. We'll figure out how long it's taken us and we'll go from there. Let's get on with it. I'll tell you what, boys. This is actually genuinely fun. I thought this was going to be shit. And there's like some moments where I fucking hate it. But for the most part, this is really fun. Just like running around, fucking getting every single quest done as quickly as possible. It's a fucking good time. I would highly recommend doing it. And there we go, guys. That is the Shades of Morton quest done. Now, I do need to go and train up my woodcutting to level 34 and use an Axeman's Folly M for a 2 boost. Uh, it says in the guide I have an option to train to 36, but obviously I'm going to take the quickest route and uh, get the Axeman's Folly. They're quite expensive, but well, you know what? I think I've got the money. Gee, that was an audacious flex. I apologize. Now, I've never tried this before because I've never had the need to be this sweaty, but I wonder if I can three tick and elk at the same time. Let's find out. Oh, okay. Hang on. We're going to go this way. Oh my God. No, no, I definitely cannot. There we go, boys. 34 woodcutting out the way. Done. We're going to move on to the next part. We're going to go do Lost City and then follow that up with, I believe, a bit of Romeo Juliet and a couple other quests at the same time. Sea Slug, maybe. Let's hook in. Right, this should be Lost City complete here. Uh, this allows us to use the DDS, which, you know, I'm probably not going to be doing for a while, but 92 quest points out of the way. Now, the next three quests we're going to be doing is Sea Slug, Fairy Tale Part 1 and finishing off Romeo and Juliet. That should put us on the 100 quest points. Let's get to it. All right, boys, this should be Fairy Tale Part 1 done. And we should have access to the fairy rings after we start number two, but that's coming later. As for now, we're going to go start Merlin's Crystal and finish off Romeo and Juliet. That should actually get us, yeah, these two quests will get us to 100 quest points straight up. Let's go. There we go, boys. Romeo and Juliet done. And that is five quest points out of the way. Now we just need to go and uh, finish off Merlin's Crystal. That should give us another quest point. Actually, I think Merlin's Crystal gives us like five quest points. So that's going to put us at 104. And then we'll go quickly check the time on the uh, on the run. Right, boys. This should be Merlin's Crystal done. There we go. What? Six quest points? Holy shit. I didn't realize you got that many. Right. 106 quest points. 105 quest points which means we only need another 70 QP and we're done with this account. Let me just quickly teleport home, talk to Hans, see what the time is on the clock. That's all right. I'm wasting an entire minute just to see where we're at. Nine hours, 18 minutes to get 105 quest points. That is not bad at all. So there we go, boys. That's going to wrap it up for part one of this series. I'll probably end up breaking it up into about four parts. The second part will definitely finish off Barrow's Gloves. Then we need to work on the requirements for DS2, like high mining and crafting and stuff like that, which shouldn't be too difficult to bang out. We might even try and speed run to the end of DS2 as well. See how quickly we can get that done. We'll probably end up being able to get it done in about 30 hours, which would be fucking sick uh but then the next few parts we will uh we'll look to finish off magic strength and and uh range and stuff like that so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to check out research his link will be in the description he only has 600 subscribers and he's doing the lord's work so make sure you go show him some love he does a bunch of speed run kind of stuff so if you guys ever thought about doing some uh you know, speed running, Barrow's gloves, trying to get it out of the way. Definitely check out his videos and he has a bunch of cool guides on his channel. So link will be in the description. Make sure you check him out, show him some love. 
that being said, guys, that's going to wrap it up. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I'll catch you in the next one tomorrow. Take it easy. Yo, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode in EV365. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm putting out a new video every single day this year. Don't forget to click that bell icon as well so you get notified when it comes out. If you guys really enjoyed the video, you could also leave a like. That really helps out the channel to get the videos in suggested and it's really good for channel growth. On top of that, if you are enjoying the videos and want to see some of these things get made live as they happen, I should stream five days a week over on Twitch. Crazy stuff like this goes down very often. Boys. <laughs> oh no, I know that noise. Oh, you have to I'm safe. I'm safe. I'm safe. I'm safe. How much cash is that? 124 mil. Holy fuck. <laughs> Muscles. Hey, hey, disgusting. Uh. Did you just fart? <laughs> And if you just want to keep up with my day-to-day -day wheelings and dealings, you can also follow me over on Twitter at EVscape Official. All links will be in the description down below. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Oh Take oh it easy. Oh my god, I bet you got killed by a fucking bear. Oh my god.